the destruction come and them just get destroyed because they never know say they are come so they are party one night and then they where what they broke up you see me and Chinese is a bit of a bit of a road and America is a bit of a time and the land. Uh, and the land camp, a the Chinese army and the American army. And they don't know how it is. Um, it's a I went to town. It's a like a thief in the like night. Like a thief in the night. Because I don't know all this shit. I don't know how to walk by and make jokes. Why? Because you want to look funny to friend him. You see how I'm crazy. You see how I'm silent. You see like a like a fussy man. You see me? I saw a nigga want to do. You see me, I'm going to party and fool around the next man who want to do it. I'm going to out in base and take some bitch with, with some blood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm going to do. But, a nigga don't want to seek the Heavenly Father. Uh -huh. You see me? So we come out here and say, look here. The Lord have mercy for it. And he's going to say, alright, he's going to deliver it from this present Egypt. Just like when he delivered it from the past Egypt. And he's going to glorify it. Right? Because we are in people. I'm going to make you immortal, I'm going to make you kings and priests and nations I'm going to serve you. You see me? According to the Bible. Right? But a nigga don't want to hear that. If on a rose gold chain or something along that line, he don't want to hear it. Ben? If on a something where he give money ben? or he give him a girl, he don't want it, yo. The dry thing, you just have to give him a girl. Yeah, you can't have a woman, I'm a girl now. <laughs> you see me? So if on a that he don't want to hear it, yo, so can the scripture say, yo, or people trust in oppression and perverseness, yo. That's what I'm trusting, yo. See? So if them hear the warning, the trumpet, and them don't want to hear, and them blood upon for them, yo. One. He, he hear the sound of the trumpet, right? And took not warning, his blood shall be upon him. But he that take a warning shall deliver his soul. But if the watchman see the sword come, and blow not the trumpet, right? And the people be not warned. If the sword, the sword come and take away person from among them, he is he is taken away in his iniquity. But his blood will I require at the watchman. Right. So our position is one of great responsibility. Seeing we were given the gift of sight, we can see the thing that we are, and the prophecies them we understand them of, of, of the Lord in purpose to bring upon the earth so now that we understand that um bushes that thing there see now that we understand yeah. so now that we understand that we can't say all right well keep it to itself because we don't come out and tell the people them say yo they may have the thing them with the lord Jaga, and we make it even better we don't just come out in the public we video it and put it on youtube so anybody in the world can see it right we not hide it we can't hide it because if we don't go out, and push this word, you see me, to the best of our ability. Then what? It has to be upon our head, yo. The Lord has to say, Why did you not? It might be like the man with eye the talent. Very, very, very see? Why you eye the talent, yo? Why you never go out and tell the people, them say, Yo, this is the thing them where they are come up on the earth, yo. That means you never love your people, because really and truly out here, we do it out of love, yo. We are warned, you say, These are the things you're about to come to pass. You see me? You find it? Yeah, I hear. Alright, now start on, this is Matthew 5 and 14. Ye are the light of the world. Right. A city that is set on a high a city that is set on high cannot be hid. Neither do man light a candle and put it under a bushel. But on a, but on a, a candlestick and give a light unto all that are in the house. Right. So we are the light of the world. Why? Because we're bringing out the scriptures, and the scriptures are light, yo. Right? So if we have this word, or the understanding of this word, and we don't come out and we don't tell you that, hey, the purpose of all is you and madness, and it's ultimately have the ship, and ultimately have the whole of the homosexuals. If we don't come out and tell you them thing here, then what? Then your head is up on our, uh, your blood is on our head. You see me? If we don't come out and tell you that, these um these current wars that's been happening for the past decade and now these shared wars that have started over the past few months are going to devolve into literal wars yo because that's how wars start start with a coin to war then a trade war one start fleeing propaganda back and forth seen until what until an, 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 a man just push a button and the war and the physical war starts so we're out here telling you that there are three wars written up 
in the book of Revelation, and the first two woes are passed, where were one, where were two, and the third woe coming quickly. You see me? And that third woe I'll go bring with it a time of trouble, seeing such as never was since the earth exists, you know, that time of Jacob's trouble. Right? Thus was about to come on the earth, yo. What? This is um Psalms 119. Um, 119 and 105. Thy word is a lamp unto my feet and a light unto my path. Right. So the word is what guides you. Um, you have a precept? Oh, you want to read the time of Jacob's story? Yeah, Daniel 3, man. And they can read Daniel 3, after that. So this is... This is Amos 3, I mean, I start at 6. Shall a trumpet be blown in the city, and the people, and the people not be afraid? The people are not afraid. Trumpet are blue right now, yo. But the people are not afraid. And they don't see it in front gone, of their eyes, yo. Gone, gone. As we said before, our people don't have vision. You see me? Go on. Shall there be evil in a city, and Yahweh had not done it? That's a question, yo. Shall there be evil in a city, and the most have not done it? So the evil that's about to be brought upon this, this world, yo. It's, it's brought by whom? The only father, yo. Why? Because it's an unrighteous kingdom, yo. We are not. As, as, as bitter as a pill, as it is swallow, we are not a righteous people, yo. We are filthy and wicked, yo. See, one of the most prevalent things in a Jamaica is phobia, which is what? Witchcraft. You don't want a nigga, don't want ear say it's a witchcraft, yo. A nigga, a, 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 a man, a good uncle, and I sell an improv, in cup, and I sell him, and I say, I want to obey it. Who comes yeah, out and start wet up a place? Yes. And, <laughs> yeah. and him going and him probably saw a white line in front of him and said, Yeah, no, I'm going to powder my house. You see me? Witchcraft. In our music, the majority of the male musicians, they want them to sing about adultery. The women, they want them to sing about adultery. You see me? With people serving false gods. Would that, would that be that false image? And Selassie. Or Allah, or, 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 or Egyptian mythology, or whatever it is, yo. See? Yeah, all these different gods, yo. So we are a wicked people, yo. So why would the Lord prolong a wicked society? Why? Scripture said, and wickedness uh, polluted the whole earth. All right. So if, you, if, if we the truly want to rest, you don't want the Lord to come back and destroy the setup, yo. You don't want a uh, egg. The average Christian don't want to see the second coming of the Lord. They want to get it in this society. Yo. They want this thing what they call a prosperity doctrine. The Lord will bless you with a house and a car and a wife or a husband and 50 kids and railway and all these things. Why don't you ask the Lord to come back and live away out of this hell hole? Yo. This, is not, this is not life. Yo. This is wicked life. Out, here, out of this wicked flesh. Paul beg to come out of the flesh. Yo. Not to continue. Paul, you want to live. The only reason why I'm still is because I'm the need to edify the churches, yo. Profitable That's the only reason why I'm still in the want to leave. No, so why, the, why would people want to stay? Why we don't want to see what people glorified, yo? See? The scripture promised that we are going to own the nations, yo. That they are going to bow before our feet and lick up the dust of our feet, yo. Why don't you want that? See? True immortality, yo. See? One. Surely, Yahweh will do nothing but he revealed his secret unto his servants, the prophet. Right. So the father now gonna do nothing before he reveal him secrets to the servants, the prophets, and tell the people, yo. From the, from the foundation, the Lord always raised up prophets, yo. Sin. To speak on his behalf, and that's what the word prophet means, to say on behalf of somebody, yo. The word prophet means a spokesperson. God. Right? So we, 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 are, we are as oracles, our ambassadors for the Heavenly Father. That's how we come out here and we say, Thus saith the Lord. We don't tell her this is my opinion, or this brother's opinion, or that next brother's opinion. No, we read from the scriptures, yo. And if somebody come to it, and they want to debate, or they want to exchange 
whatever, whatever, it might come out of this. Uh, we're not going to have nothing un un unfruitful debate, yo. I mean, a sense. If no it's problem, not under edification, it's not it's the egg. It's the next thing, um, to be honest, it's not about proving anything to nobody, yo. It's just for what is something that belief. Shall the unbelief make the faith of God without the strength? Suppose one day you get up and you decide so you don't believe in a gravity. I decide if you go for the sun and jump out. You think gravity is more, yo? You still have to jump and broke your freaking neck. You see me? If you don't, if you, if you don't believe that you can die, I decide, all right, yo, I believe I'm immortal already. I'm going to walk out in the car and I can't boop you. Tell the car, say immortal, no? So it doesn't matter if a nigga don't believe that the things that are written are about to come to pass. See? That now have no effect from the prophecies, yo. Because the Lord already purpose it, yo. If it's written, Shadow. it can go happen. You see me? That's it. That's the end of, end of, end of be all, yo. See? Your pastors, we have, they, they, they learn this doctrine. A seminary school, what they call um, conditional prophecies. That the prophecies in the Bible are conditional, depending on what man does. <laughs> like God has sit on a weed for you to make up your mind. Yeah. You know, I wonder if I'm going to pick me today. I'm going to pick it up. No, Reggie. The Lord already chose who he's going to deliver and who he's condemned to unrighteousness. Yo. That's, that's, that's in the scripture. Yo. It's our DNA, yo. It was ordained for Israel to go off. It was ordained for Israel to go into captivity. It was ordained for a remnant of Israel to repent. It was ordained for a remnant to get mercy through Yahweh, get delivered, re-establish their land, get the law, keep the law, and the whole Israel will be righteous. That's the whole NRB all, yo. That's the whole thing. So the whole thing you don't get planned already, yo. So it was not some kind of arm. Um, it was not some kind of arm. Um, we call it now. Surprise. That Moses said to them face, yo. So look here, when they got stiff naked people, I'm going to break the law. Then. The same day when they give them, he said, look here, we're not going to break it. I already know. He already know because the Lord show him. The scripture said the Lord show Moses the beginning and the middle of the end of the times, yo. Done. So Moses didn't know. So we're going to go off. And he tell them. And he tell them. Left them. <laughs> he tell them. So you're going to scatter among all the nations for a reproach. Isn't it? We're not gonna live like dogs, breaking all kind of laws, serving all kind of different gods, becoming enemies, becoming, becoming slaves to like your enemies. Isn't it? All these things were prophesied to happen to our people at the time. The lion had roared, who will not fear? Yahweh of our Simeon's son had spoken, who can but prophesy? Right. So the Lord has spoken, who can but prophesy? Oh, so the prophecy is there. And this is one of the major prophecies seen, that we look forward to, we look forward to. Not in the sense that we would love to go through that trouble, but we know that after the trouble comes deliverance. So you must come. You must have to come. Go on. This is Jeremiah chapter 30 verse 7. Alas, for that day is great, so that none is like it. It is even the time of Jacob's trouble, but he shall be saved out of it. Right, so a remnant of the nation of Israel are going to be saved out of the trouble that's about to come to pass, yo. Then, um, in America right now, then, it's, it's evident that racism is alive and well. Or well, people don't know it, but it's alive and well. There are certain legislation that are put in place, then, Fair, fair. Go against certain groups of black people with certain things, yo. Matter of fact, in the same legislation that labels us as black extremists, it labels um, end time prophecy believers as also malignant to the government, yo. So if you believe in the end time prophecies and all them things, you are an enemy of the state. You see me? Who in the majority of the churches in America, yo? Black people, yo. Our people, blacks, Latinas, Native American, Indians. All people, yo. You see me? So you are labeled as what? As an enemy of the state. And let us not forget that from the foundation, he started one revenge from Jacob to take the um, the birthright, yo. You see me? That, that's written in the scriptures, yo. He um, saw make a vow to destroy our people, yo. Especially after our David take them down and put them in a captivity, yo. You see me? Every chance them get, them supplant me after that, yo. And go against you side with your enemy and know them have the rule over you. So, our people have forgotten 
that them living at the land of them enemy, yo. our people have forgotten the atrocities where the so-called white man commit against the people over centuries. Yo. And they bring up David, uh, David even tell them in the Psalms. Remember, remember Edom. Edom. If 